I'm titling this little video, What's Wrong With This Picture? This is the one where uh, I had made some changes and sent this back to you. And it looks okay here, Article 1, and you can see if I click up here, Heading 1 is the style it's using. And then this is Level 2, and I was using Heading 2. And if we'd gone deeper, it would have been Heading 3, Heading 4 for different levels. But if you were to come along and come down here and say, okay, maybe you need Article 2 here. Um, put the heading one style on and I'm going to press shift enter and then type I don't know another heading. I'm not sure what's going on here but there is some weird formatting on this uh, paragraph up here. If I click on this and press control Q on my keyboard it resets this. Somebody probably had told it to start at one and it was messing things up but at any rate here's article one, article two and if I do another one now, you'll see I get Article 3. I don't really want that, though. Okay, but here's the big problem. Article 2, but this still says 1.3, even though if I click on it, it does have the right style. So first, what I did to create the outline was if I click on one of these and I go into this multi-level list, what I need to do is say define new list. Not new multi-level list, but new list. The difference being these, you make it, you can never modify it. It's And it doesn't let you name it. It's it's You don't want that. Define new list, and then if I came in here, I could give it a name, and then go into format, numbering, and set everything up. Now I already did that. Let me cancel out of here. So you'll notice if I'm on article one, and I go to my pull down list. Here it is. And if I rest over it, see how it says my outline? That's what I named it. It's up here. And then down here, it is again. Down here under list styles, you'll basically see all of them. This is the one currently being used. Now, the problem you had was when you went in here, you were probably on one of these heading two ones. And so when you went to the multi level list, you were like, hey, I don't see it. This isn't it. It's actually down here, uh, but who would know that, right? So let me show you what happened. And this was actually something I did wrong, but you can um, learn for yourself from this. So I'll click back on a level one, go to my multi-level list, and I can right-click this and say I want to modify it. Or I could have grabbed the one down below. It doesn't matter. Here's my outline. I can say Format Numbering. And here's all the numbering. Now notice this little more and less button. You want to make sure that this stuff is showing. So over to the left here I have level 1 and here's all the information for level 1. It's got the heading 1 style link to it. It's going to be level 1 of my outline. This is what the number is going to look like and so on. If I click on number 2, notice it says link to style no style. That's where I messed up. I could have sworn I put heading 2 in there but I must have clicked out of it or something. So I need to find Heading 2. There it is. Now Heading 2 is going to be part of your outline and it will behave. Uh, so then we would want to look at this to make sure it's all set up right. I'm just going to get rid of this number here altogether and for no, uh, Level 2 and Level 3 I'll show you how to set these up in case you have to do it from scratch on your own. Uh, so for Level 2 the first thing you want is whatever the first level was, level one. So I choose that, and then I can press period. Oh, this is messed up. See how this is disabled? I can't click number for this style. I need to turn off legal style numbering here for a minute. Uh, and I don't know if you can tell, but when I did, this one became like a Roman numeral. That's because up at the top, article one, it's a Roman numeral, but don't worry about that yet. So then I want this. So I've got whatever the first level was, a period, and then the number for the current level. Now if I check legal style numbering, they'll both show up as the Arabic one and not regardless of what this was formatted as. And let's say I'm happy with everything else. I say OK. Oh, I forgot to do level three. So I'll go back in, format numbering. Got level one, we've got level two. Here's level three. It's connected to the right style, that's good. Um, and here are these numbers. So just in case something's not quite right with these, let's get rid of all of these and I'll show you how to put them in. So this is grayed out again, so let me clear the legal style numbering. 
So what do we want first? Well, we want whatever level one of the outline was, followed by a period, followed by level two of the outline, followed by a period, followed by the current level looking like the Arabic one, two, three, and then we want to say legal style numbering so they all show up as the Arabic one, two, three. And we'll just assume that the indentation and all that stuff over here is good. Say OK, OK. Now let's see. Oh, look, it's like magic. It's now 2.1. And if, let me scroll down a little bit, let's say right here we wanted level 3, it should be what? It should be 2.2.1, right? So if I choose heading 3, it is indeed. Now if I do heading 3 again, there it is. Oh, and while we're here, while we're gathered here, see how when I press enter I'm not getting the next number? I find that kind of annoying. Uh, and I'm going to turn show hide on. First of all, <sighs> excuse me, we do not use empty hard returns to space paragraphs. That's just so wrong. Um, and what was, what was I going to tell you? Oh, because when we also when we press enter, we want to get the next number. Um, so if we want to set it up to have the spacing we want and give us the next number, this is heading three. I'd go up here, modify, and I would say format the paragraph for heading three to have 12 point space after, so I have the spacing I want. And then here for the style heading three, if I choose heading three for the following style, now when I press enter, it'll keep giving me heading three. And then when I'm ready for something else, I could choose it. And I would probably do that for all of these. Heading two, heading two, when I'm done with it. Format paragraph, 12 point space after. Okay, so now you know what was wrong with the picture.